What's up guys? Today's video is of course the Eiffel Tower review. We have finally finished this absolute behemoth of a set. This is absolutely awesome. Up here we have the dimensions. We have 57 centimeters wide or 22 inches and of course 149 centimeters tall which is equal to 58 inches. So overall we're looking at about a five foot height here which is just absolutely super tall. Something I really like about the box here is you open it up and first off, you have this quote by Gustav Eiffel. Uh, there is an attraction and a charm inherent in the colossal that is not subject to ordinary theories of art. The tower will be the tallest edifice ever raised by man. Will it therefore be imposing in its own way by Gr Gustav Eiffel? And on the back of the box, of course, we have, you can take it apart in uh, three, four sections. Um, and we have a real life picture of it, which I love that they're doing now, like a uh, Lego display and of course a real display. I really like how they're doing that. So let's start at the base here. We have so much detail with these trees and little walkways. I'm really excited to put some minifigures in here and just make it look super epic. Maybe even like a tower battle, like kind of like the Spider-Man Ultimate Bridge battle, but just like Paris in an absolute insane Star Wars or Marvel battle. So as we come up here to the kind of the second level here, uh, we're looking at really lots of these, uh, I call them ship pieces uh, for the steering wheel of a pirate ship. But this thing is crazy. We can look down, um, down there at the bottom there, um, and we can continue to go up. As we go up here, I think these are birds. I'm not sure what those uh, colored pieces are in there for. Uh, maybe just coordination, but it goes all the way around. This is crazy. Here's a shot from inside of the Eiffel Tower as we climb up. Um, it is, it just keeps growing and growing. It keeps going up and up and up to the very top. So guys, just to give you an example of how big this actually is, my hand is about that big compared to the entire build and the top parts really cover a lot of ground. So is this worth basically $700? I personally would say yes. It is close though. Uh, it took me a while to build and the experience was super fun, by the way. Super relaxing. There's a lot of, lot of repetition, but when you just want to sit down and build a Lego set, this is what you got to build because it just took me forever. It was so fun to build and I got to see the progress along. Let me show you the parts that you can take off. First of all, we have the top part. It's right here. I'm just going to slide that off there real quick. And put it down so this is the very tippy top with the um french flag and yeah we got a lot of hot dogs on here too and there's a lot of pieces all right the next part is bigger it's going to cover this part and up so let me just take it down real quick so look at this thing so this is what gains the most ground here this is probably the tallest uh, module part that uh is in this set again this is really big compared to my hand uh it is big i do have to be careful with it i don't want to break anything because some of the pieces are just clipped on like you can see a little bend stuff um, but overall it is very strong and durable and this final part is what we're going to take off last awesome so here we go look at this thing oh my goodness gracious whoa now we're just looking straight down into tons of trees and you can see the shadow looks so cool it almost looks like a star almost um, and the detail on here is super amazing. The, these cords, um, really support this thing. Also, we, there's roller coaster pieces here, um, as supports. But again, you have to be careful here because it's only connected by, uh, two stud deep depth of, uh, studs right there. So, let's put it all back together. Can I do it with one hand? Oh boy. Just go, yep. Slide it on. There's nothing crazy about how they fit. Just go boom. And then of course the topper. This one literally just slides on. It does. There is no click, nothing. Just boom. There we are. All right, guys, that will be all for today's review of the Eiffel Tower. Um, again, this has no minifigures, but you do get the free promo with it. So I'd encourage you to possibly try to find that. That is probably one of the coolest parts about this. But again, if you want to have a five foot tall masterpiece, this is the way to go. Lego's tallest, like I said, ever built. Um, 
and of course 10,000 pieces which is my new record so this is just amazing to have here's a really cool side shot of the box here just the sheer detail on this is fantastic and of course this set is fantastic guys again 700 is a steep price for this uh it did not sell out the day of so i'm not surprised there but again as always drop down give me 20 peace out guys jack psychos have a great day